Hey everyone. Have you ever logged into your bank account and seen a mysterious charge from Rocket Money? You stare at it, heart pounding, mind racing, did I sign up for something? Did they sneak a subscription in there? Relax, take a deep breath. You're not alone. This has happened to plenty of folks, and today we're going to decipher the code behind those Rocket Money charges. Now, Rocket Money itself is a financial app offering budgeting tools and bill negotiation services. Sounds helpful, right? But here's the thing, while the basic app is free, there are hidden corners where you might have unknowingly triggered a charge. Let's explore those hidden alleys. Mystery solved number one, the bill negotiation bounty. Imagine this, you're tired of those ever-increasing cable bills. Rocket Money swoops in, promising to negotiate lower rates with your provider. Sounds like a win-win. But here's the catch. If their negotiation is successful and you save money on your bill, Rocket Money takes a cut, between 30% and 60% of your first year's savings. That's right, a success fee. It's not exactly a hidden charge, but it's easy to miss the fine print during sign-up. So, if you use their bill negotiation and they saved you money, that charge might be your bounty for a lighter bill. Mystery solved number two, the premium perks pit stop. Rocket Money offers a premium membership with fancy features like budgeting breakdowns and custom spending categories. Monthly fees for this membership range from $4 to $12. Now, you might be thinking, there's no way I signed up for that. But here's the thing. Sometimes during the free trial period, if you don't explicitly cancel before it ends, you automatically get switched to the paid membership. So, that rocket money charge could be for premium features you never intended to use. Don't worry, we'll cover how to check and cancel that in a minute. Mystery solved number 3, the misunderstood savings shuffle. This one's a bit tricky. Rocket Money offers a smart savings feature that automatically transfers money from your checking account into a linked high-yield savings account. Sounds good, right? Well, the thing is, these transfers might show up on your statement as debits from Rocket Money. But fear not, it's not actually a charge, just your hard-earned cash being squirreled away for a rainy day. Here's how to decipher your Rocket Money charge. Check your account details. First, log into your Rocket Money account. They should have a clear breakdown of your charges and their purpose. Review transaction descriptions, look for keywords like bill negotiation fee, premium membership, or savings transfer. These will give you a strong hint about the nature of the charge. Feeling charged up. How to take control. If you see a charge for a service you didn't use or no longer want, here's what to do. Cancel premium membership, log into your Rocket Money account and navigate to the Settings or Billing section. You should find an option to cancel your premium membership. Dispute unwanted charges. If you believe a charge is truly mistaken, contact Rocket Money's customer support. Explain the situation and request a refund. Rocket Money can be a helpful tool, but it's vital to understand their pricing structure and features before you dive in. By being aware of potential charges and how to manage them, you can keep your finances on track and avoid any unwelcome surprises in your bank statement. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.